Congratulations, world record. How's the feeling right now? Uh, first of all, thank you. Um, yeah, I think it's a very special feeling. Um, I think I owed this to the team for quite a while now, and it's finally came off. So it's a good feeling. First of all, getting the win as well. A special moment for us as a team. Yeah, um, I think it's a special, special day out for me today. It was outpouring emotions in the middle just after you got the hundred. Uh, what strike to your mind after getting that one? Uh, just pure emotion. I wanted to cry actually. So um, it's my first hundred for Namibia. Um, like I said, I felt I've owed this to the team for quite a while. Um, so yeah, just pure emotion and happiness. Yes. In the previous game, you missed out on the 55 round out and you look very dejected when you're going back. Uh, do you think, did it strike in your mind when you were in the middle today that another landmark? Not really, no. I'm not really a big guy on landmarks. Um, as long as you can contribute to the team's performance and everything, um, landmarks aren't always, always going to help you win, win games. So yeah, I, don't, I didn't think about it too much today. Um, I mean, what happened in the past, you can't change it. So. You're on the 11th over. Uh, did, when did it strike that you could reach that mark? Uh, I think it was in the 17th over. I thought to myself, okay, there's about 20 balls left, and I know what I can do. So I think I realised then that I'm still on for 100 here today. You're playing a, a lot of unorthodox top shots, like universe switch and everything. Uh, were, were you confident uh, after that uh, big over in your second over? Yes, um, yeah, that's, look, it's my type of game to go to the reverse sweeps, laps and all those things. So if I just back myself and continue doing it, doing it I believe I'll get a lot of success from it. Uh, Gerard was uh, absent today. Any injuries or any concerns about his fitness? Yes, a um, little niggle for Erasmus, but um, I'm sure he'll bounce back from it and be ready, hopefully, by the next game or the next or the second to last game. This is also the fastest T20 century. Uh, were you aware of that when you were in the middle? No, actually, I thought Kushal Mala had the fastest 29 balls. Um, but yeah, some guys came afterwards and told me that it's the fastest, and I didn't want to believe them. But yeah, now I've heard it is. So I think it's a special feeling and special special day for me. Congratulations, and all the best for this game. Thank you very much.